What's going on guys, this is Ryan from Learn Oyster Kids, and today we're going to be doing a quick app review of the app Weebly. If you've never heard of this app, it is an app that basically allows you to create websites quickly on iOS and Android devices. Um, and yeah, it's pretty cool, it allows you to make mobile sites, normal sites, and we're just going to be showing you guys the basics of this app today, and what things skills you can use while creating this app. So let's just get right into it. Um, so the first thing that happens when you, once you open up this app is, as you can see, I have no websites created, so I'm just going to go ahead and click create your site. Um, the first thing that asks you to do is basically pick a theme this you can change later so don't worry about it too much but you can browse through some of them all um they're categorized by like online store business portfolio personal events etc um we'll just pick maybe something like um personal right now like i said you can change it later so it's good to kind of browse through them be a little flexible and kind of um play around a little bit before you solidify your entire um your entire website so we're just going to pick a random one i'm thinking maybe this one right here called capturing moments paper or something um not really sure what it is we'll look into it and um, add some stuff so once you pick your theme it throws you to this um screen right here which it allows you to either publish your site see your stats unlock more features etc it's basically um what places that you can see how your website's doing um publish it um unlock special features to promote it like for search engines and stuff like that but the first thing you're going to want to do is go to the top right and click edit site once you click edit site this is the main editor of your entire website the you'll notice that the main theme has has like some background pictures and stuff to go with um but what you really want to start doing is right when you right when you open up your theme is at the top there's a little plus button you're just going to want to click on it and click build from here you can add all different things i have some pictures of my of my little hamster type creatures on my ipad so i'm thinking i'll put a, i'll drag a title so you can basically hold on any one of these elements drag it put it anywhere i'll put a title right at the top and title it um um I don't know something something simple maybe my pets or something we'll we'll say this is a basically a page to um showcase my pets or something so now there's a title at the top um you can edit it all in all different types of way but we're just kind of showing the real basics today um as well as you can add pictures and stuff like this um see how it says drag elements here so it's basically sections that i can add stuff if i wanted you can add as you can see slide shows pictures all different th types of things we'll just add a picture um why not and a little one a little picture of my little degu hamster smiling um, so now I have basically my pets at the top, a little picture of them, et cetera, et cetera. Obviously, this is very basic, but you can add a lot of things. Um, you can add things like maps, uh, contact forms, newsletter buttons, uh, videos, blogs, social icons, anything that you want. As well as at the top, um, you can see if there's basically builds, pages, and themes. You can have different pages for your website. So if I click on pages, this is the home page of my website, but I can go to the about page. You can also customize these and change these however if I wanted to make a little about page for each one of my pets I could um, if I wanted to go back to pages and then click on contact if um let's just saying I was breeding pets and I wanted to sell them or basically find them homes I could put a contact area so people can can basically find me on social media add some social media buttons let's drag the social media icon thing to the contact me page or, or add my email etc see the through here I can add all different type, types of things like Facebook's and stuff and like I said at the top, you can change the theme as well if you want. So let's just pretend that my website is done. Um, all you have to do is click preview and you can see um, how the website looks basically on desktop or on um, the mobile device. So we're just going to go to the home page and take a look at it. As you can see, this is basically this is a great way to practice your organization skills, whether it be something like organizing the books in your backpack. Or organizing an event to invite a bunch of your friends and meet up at a park or something it's the same type of thing within this website um, your website you could use it for any type of thing whether you want it to be business or just kind of a gallery um, you can organize it with your pictures you can organize it with videos blog posts whatever you want and basically keep editing it till it's exactly how you want it so if I click on the mobile button at the top I can see how it look on a phone or any type of mobile device or I can see how it look on a desktop as well as you can click the top left to change the pages to see how each page would like would look like as you can see a lot of these pages aren't empty because they really didn't edit it too much but yeah that's the basics so once you're done you can click preview and then you can click publish at the top left from here you can search for your own domain name or connect your own meaning that if i if i own the domain name um 
ryanpets.com i could connect it or i could search for one using this app so it's extremely simple to create your own website using this app you should definitely try it out um, if you've never made a website if you want a simple platform to kind of put your things out in the world and sort of the internet it's a nice place to start in a very comfortable relaxing environment hope you guys learned a little bit today and um, try out the app weebly if you're interested in setting up your own website bye